Hi, Nick Collier here, and this is my shop. Come join me. We'll have some fun. All right, well, next on the agenda is uh, these sleeves are going to be welded on the inside, and they fit a two-inch bar. He says also uh, standard bars are one in, uh, one in 15 sixteenths and one in 900 thousandths. So he wants to make uh, some inserts to be able to clamp down on one and fifteen sixteenths and one and nine hundred. So uh, we found a piece of uh, aluminum on our scrap pile. We're going to take that and start turning it down and come up with something that's going to work. First we're going to take the boring bar out. All right, put this tool in except that it's a little bit dull. We're going to bring this on over here. So we're going to take it out and take it over and sharpen it. Nice thing about high-speed tooling. Uh, All right, let's give it a shot. So we want to come over two widths, which is going to be just a little shy of that, actually. So let's pull this out just a little bit. not going to be enough for two of them. We might have to put another bit in. You know, one that's a left-hand bit. And this bit here is dull as hell, so we're going to have to go in and do a little sharpening. Maybe I can find something else. All right, well, this could work. Get it in there. It'll go in just that little bit further. Uh, the tip needs to be sharpened, but um, hey, whatever. All right, I think we got her. Let's uh, get started. <laughs>
All right, we got two done, and we need to do two more. Uh, these are at nine hundred thousandths in the inside, and we need to do two more at nine thirty nine three fifty, <laughs> which is gonna leave almost nothing. No, nine thirty five. I don't know, but it's a sleeve, so it doesn't take any strength. And we'll be back. Okay, we're in the studio part of my shop uh, uh, because uh, I have a much more accurate uh, jeweler's saw in here. So we've measured each one of our rings uh, halfway and we want to cut that line but we want to be fairly accurate so that's why we're in here. All right, let's just get started and see what we can do. Well, the braid broke just in time. We'll be back. Not that these edges need much squaring up, but they are just a little bit rough. Just a little bit of surface uh, sanding. <laughs> Alright, back to the table. Okay, now we gotta mark these things because uh, they could easily get confused. So we're gonna take this and we're gonna just put a single dot right in the center here. Yep. And then a single dot right here. Okay, that's set number one. There's two. That's good.
All right, well, we've got our indicators. Can you see them? Probably. There we go. All right, well, everything's in place. It's preheated. It's hot enough that I can't really touch it. Uh, these sleeves are pushed all the way up against this inside wall so that we've got a nice, nice fit there. And we're going to... Uh, come in and throw a bead here and a bead here and one over here and one over here but first we're going to tack them as usual and my wife just walked in so hey I'll be back okay let's do this we're gonna throw a couple of tacks in right there and there and then go around to the other side and and go ahead and run that weld let's see how it how it acts um, let me make sure that we're nice and snug here. Yeah. That looks good. That's a good bead there. That's good here and here and here it misses just a little bit. But I think we've got more than enough beef here to do what we need to do. All right, we'll put That's better. Okay, so bring it up close. We've got a bead there. That one came out beautiful there. And then we've got two, oh, half inch long ones on either end there. And I think that's gonna be plenty. At least one can only hope. Well, we welded up these little corners, so now we got to come back and just take them back down so that that is a nice even surface. And I think I'm just going to do it with a hand file because I'm hoping that it's not going to take very long.
All right, so here it is. Uh, it is complete. Uh, he doesn't want a finish on the surface, uh, which driving me crazy because, uh, you know, it's so inconsistent. But, you know, it's what he wants. It's what he wants, right? Um, so we got her done. Uh, I'm going to take it apart here real quick, like. Anyhow, this goes in there like that. This part goes back on here. And uh, everybody fits pretty well. And I think that's going to be pretty much it. So, uh, you know, uh, another project out the door. A uh, couple of bucks coming my way. I'm happy. Um, and uh, we got more projects coming down the pike here, of course. Um, this is Nick Collier checking out.